February may be the shortest month of the year, but that doesn't mean Netflix is skimping on the new and original programming. There's a lot to look forward to in February, from the Netflix original series Altered Carbon to Duncan Jones's long-awaited sci-fi noir Mute. And that's just scratching the surface. Here's everything coming to Netflix in February 2018, starting with the Netflix originals. Altered Carbon Season 1 Richard K. Morgan's series of hard-boiled futuristic noir novels has a huge following among science fiction fans, and by the looks of the teasers Netflix has been releasing, those fans will have plenty to love about the upcoming series. The story follows Takeshi Kovacs, a soldier whose mind was imprisoned for hundreds of years. How long have I been down? 250 years. In the future, he's awoken and given a new body to solve a murder, kicking off a series of events that leads him deep into a web of conspiracy. Altered Carbon is definitely going to be one of the highlights next month, so check it out on February 2nd. On Body and Soul this Hungarian fantasy drama was announced as one of the contenders for Best Foreign Language Film at the 2018 Oscars, but Netflix isn't waiting to see the results before giving it an exclusive international release on their service. The story centers on two strangers who find out that they've been having eerily similar dreams every night, so they set out to recreate those dreams in real life in the hopes of figuring out what it all means. The Guardian gave on Body and Soul a glowing review, calling it a bizarre and brutal tale of lovers and the slaughterhouse. This is definitely one to put on the radar for February 2nd. Coach Snoop Season 1 Starring everyone's favorite D.O.Double-G, Coach Snoop takes a rapper out of the studio and onto the 40-yard line as the coach of a youth league football team. It sounds like the setup for a sports-themed spin-off of Half-Baked, but from the looks of it, Coach Snoop is taking a long, hard hit of inspirational drama, focusing on the real-life stories of at-risk kids fighting for a future on the gridiron. There's no comedy here, just a Hail Mary aimed straight at your heart. Y'all ever heard that story, David and Goliath? We are David today, y'all understand? Yes, the eight-episode first season kicks off on February 2nd. Queer Eye Season 1 The reboot of the groundbreaking reality show Queer Eye for the Straight Guy sees five gay fashion gurus, the Fab Five, as Netflix describes them, working with fashion-challenged people to introduce a little sophistication into their lives. I'd like the Fab Five to help me get out of my comfort zone. It's the old show rebooted for the world of today, with a renewed focus on acceptance for the LGBTQ community, along with plenty of handmade guacamole and fabulous beards, of course. Ooh, yes balance, yes symmetry. Check out Queer Eye when it splashes onto Netflix on February 7th. The Ritual it wouldn't be a good month on Netflix without a few original horror releases, and the ritual fills that quota early. The story follows four friends on a backpacking trip through Scandinavia. They decide to take a shortcut through a dense forest, which, of course, is the wrong decision. We go southwest through here. We cut the journey in half. Or through the forest. The path leads them into a confrontation with an evil force connected to an ancient Norse ritual. The movie starts with a fairly standard premise, but elevates it with beautiful scenery and a refreshing self-awareness that takes this a notch above your typical paranormal horror film. Well, this is clearly the house we'll get murdered in. Enter the woods on February 9th. The Trader this Netflix original documentary offers a bleak look into rural life in Eastern Europe, centering on a man traveling across Georgia selling knickknacks and secondhand clothes in exchange for the only currency with any meaning in a land stricken by poverty and hunger – potatoes. The trader is sure to be an eye-opening experience. Step outside your comfort zone and queue it up on February 9th. Fate Apocrypha Part 2 the first part of Netflix's original anime series, Fate Apocrypha, was released in 2017 to generally favorable reviews, and the second part of season 1 is slated to roll out February 9th, completing the first season story arc. Tune in for part 2 this winter. My next guest needs no introduction with David Letterman, George Clooney. Late-night icon David Letterman teamed up with Netflix in January 2018 for the first installment of his new interview series, which saw Letterman sitting down with former President Barack Obama for an hour-long interview about politics and beards. You and I are the same age. Uh, <laughs> it's just he's got, this, he's got this biblical beard, you know, but uh, it's like, I'm regarded. do you have a staff? Unlike most of its shows, Netflix is releasing this series one episode at a time, and the next one will feature George Clooney in the guest seat. Take a look on February 9th. Seeing All Red 
Netflix is chiming in on the wave of allegations that permeated the news in 2017 with Seeing All Red. A documentary following activist attorney Gloria Allred. As a lawyer, Allred has represented multiple clients involved in lawsuits against famous celebrities and is a vocal opponent of discrimination. See the documentary on February 9th. When We First Met Starring Adam Devine from Workaholics, When We First Met is a comedy fantasy about a guy who found the girl of his dreams and then blew his chance with her. Three years later, he gets the chance to go back in time to the night he messed everything up to try and fix things. Cue it up on February 9th. Greenhouse Academy Season 2 this high school series debuted its first season in 2017 and follows two twin teenagers who enroll at a futuristic boarding school. Unfortunately, there's some kind of global conspiracy in the works, and it's up to them to stop it before the evil masterminds can destroy the Earth. Also, there's a bunch of teen drama and whatnot. What is this, the fourth grade or something? <sighs> If you're over the age of, say, 14, there probably isn't a whole lot here for you. But if you're a 12-year-old girl, you might just find your new favorite show. Season 2 lands on February 14th. Love Per Square Foot Touted as the first mainstream Indian film to be released by Netflix on a global scale, Love Per Square Foot is a romantic comedy about a man and a woman who decide to get married so that they can afford an apartment in Mumbai. It's bound to be an interesting experience, if nothing else. Check it out on February 14th. Remind Season 1 this Japanese series starts with 11 classmates who wake up in a locked room with no idea how they got there. The more clues they uncover about their situation, the deeper the threat to their lives appear to be. Figure out the mystery when Remind lands on February 15th. First Team Juventus this documentary miniseries tags along with the stars of the Italian football team Juventus as they kick their way through the grueling 2017 to 2018 season. First Team promises to go behind the scenes with the team to reveal their lives both on and off the field. If you're a fan of the black and white, check out the first three episodes on February 16th. Everything Sucks Season 1 Move over, 80s nostalgia, there's a new decade in town. Everything Sucks follows a high school AV club in 1996, when VCRs, Discmans, and iron-on backpack patches reign supreme. If you missed the days when Alanis Morissette and the Goo Goo Dolls were the soundtrack for everything, check out the first season of Everything Sucks on February 16th. You might regret it, but that would just mean the show really nailed what the 90s were all about. The Joel McHale Show with Joel McHale you may recognize Joel McHale from the long-running NBC show Community or from his E-series The Soup, or any of the long list of movies and shows where he's inevitably played a horrible, morally bankrupt person. I can pick up this pencil, tell you its name is Steve, and go like this. Oh. And part of you dies. Just a little bit on the inside. On February 18th, McHale lands on Netflix with The Joel McHale Show with Joel McHale, a ridiculously named show that will see McHale going back to his sketch talk show roots, green screen and all. Can we say McHale anymore? Full Metal Alchemist Don't get too excited about a Netflix-produced version of the classic anime Full Metal Alchemist. This is a rebranding of the 2017 live-action adaptation produced in Japan, a film that wasn't particularly well-received by critics. If you haven't seen it yet, you can form your own opinion when the movie premieres on Netflix on February 19th. The Frankenstein Chronicles Season 1 and 2 For residents of the UK, The Frankenstein Chronicles might already be a familiar show. The series stars Sean Bean as a detective in the 1800s who's on the trail of a madman who may or may not be Dr. Frankenstein. Netflix picked up the acclaimed horror mystery series in December 2017 for global release and rebranded it as a Netflix original. Tune in when both seasons hit on February 20th. 7 Seconds Season 1 after a tragic, racially charged accident involving a black teenager in New York City, one family fights to prevent a bureaucratic cover-up in this harrowing crime thriller. Seven Seconds stars Regina King and Claire Hope Ashete. Take a look when the first season lands on February 23rd. Marseille Season 2 Netflix's French-language political thriller Marseille hasn't made a ton of waves yet, but fans of the show have been hoping for a second season ever since the first one debuted in 2016. The show centers on the mayor of Marseille as he squares off against his successor and rival, and it offers plenty of political intrigue and bureaucratic backstabbing. It's a touch formulaic, but it should satisfy any political thriller buff on the hunt for a bingeable House of Cards replacement. Catch the second season on February 23rd. Mute 
Director Duncan Jones has been working on this film for over a decade, and the wait is finally over on February 23rd. In a near-future Berlin, a mute bartender forges a path through the city's twisted underbelly on a quest to find his missing girlfriend. Alexander Skarsgård stars with Paul Rudd and Justin Thoreau in supporting roles. Ugly Delicious Get your forks ready because there's a brand new food and culture show on the horizon. Ugly Delicious delves into the on-street cuisine with chef David Chang. Rude waiters, dirty bathrooms, in Ugly Delicious, it doesn't matter as long as the food is good. Take the trip on February 23rd. Darren Brown, The Push Illusionist Darren Brown is known for his controversial shows and psychological experiments, and Darren Brown The Push is bound to be an interesting addition to the performer's lineup. Most of the details regarding the show are being kept quiet, so we'll all have to wait until February 27th to find out where Darren Brown takes us next. Original Stand-Up Comedy Netflix has been loading up on stand-up specials in the past couple of months, but the streaming service is only bringing three new specials into the fold in February. Kevin J, Everybody Calm Down, was originally slated for a January release, but has since been pushed back to February 2nd. On February 6th, you can tune in to Fred Armisen, Stand Up For Drummers. And February 27th, we'll see comedian and actor Marlon Wayans' hour-long stand-up special, Wokish. That covers all the Netflix originals coming in February. Now here are all the other movies and TV shows arriving next month. New Movies February is going to be a great month to relive the action classics of the past. Quentin Tarantino's Kill Bill Volumes 1 and 2 will both be arriving on the first of the month, along with 3,000 Miles to Graceland, to name a few. For more dramatic fare, Netflix is doubling down on their gangland classics with Martin Scorsese's Goodfellas. That arrives on the first of the month, along with the Ocean Eleven's trilogy and the 2008 Oscar winner The Hurt Locker. And if those don't get the Valentine's mood rolling, Netflix is rolling out every unromantic comedy it can get its hands on. The first of the month is heralding five American Pie movies, along with Meet the Parents and its sequel with the funny name and John C. Riley's irreverent musical saga, Walk Hard, The Dewey Cox Story. There's two things you need to know. Uh -huh. I'm the king, and number two is- Look out, man! Look at that, you're coming at you, you see that? And speaking of music, February 1st will also see some great new documentary releases, like how the Beatles changed the world. Later in the month, look for Winnie, a 2017 documentary about Winnie Mandela, activist and former wife of Nelson Mandela. That premieres on February 26th. Perhaps mercifully, Netflix is only adding two family films in February. Less mercifully, one of them is the Emoji Movie, one of the most soul-crushingly bad animated films in history. You can look forward to that on February 8th. Ella Enchanted also arrives on the first of the month. After the kids go to bed, turn off the lights and enjoy Netflix's new thriller lineup. Look for Scream 3 on the first, the 2016 Cabin Fever remake on the second, Blood Money on the 17th, and Dismissed on the 19th. Finally, February 24th sees the arrival of Jeepers Creepers 3. New Television Fans of thrilling television will have a lot to look forward to come February. On the first of the month, Season 4 of Z Nation arrives, followed by Season 1 of Valor five days later, and Season 1 of The Imposters the following day on February 7th. After that, keep an eye out for the thrilling fifth and final season of Bates Motel on the 20th. Thanks for watching. Click the looper icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.